Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I've never made a video like this before, but my dad is actually getting LASIK tomorrow, so we wanted to make a video about what the experience was like. So do you want to tell them a little bit about why you're getting LASIK? I'm sick of these. I've been wearing glasses for a long time. Uh, I've tried contact lenses. I wore contact lenses for a long time, but the whole thing is just a pain in the ass, either putting on contact lenses or putting on glasses every day. So I've had enough and I'm finally gonna get surgery tomorrow and it's gonna get fixed. So maybe you should start by telling them how bad your vision really is. Ooh, how bad is my vision? I think it's like minus six and a half in one eye and I forget what it is in the other, minus four or something like that. Um, translating that for you, it means really bad. It means I can see you see, I can see about this far. I can see about eight inches clearly, and everything after that is blurry. Wow, that's really bad. Yeah, I got pretty bad vision. So would you say that you're more excited or scared for it? Gosh, um, I'm anxious for it, and I would say about 90% of it is excitement, and maybe 10% of it is just a little bit of fear. Yeah, when you first told me that you were doing it, I was pretty scared for you because Something could happen and then you could never be able to see it again at all. Well, I went to this place in San Francisco and they really showed me around. They showed me everything. They showed me how easy it is and uh, I feel pretty comfortable. You know, thousands of people get this done every day, so it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Yeah. So what time is the surgery at tomorrow? So the surgery's at 10.30 tomorrow and so by this time tomorrow, I'll be resting, but I'll be able to see. So I'm gonna be recording the whole experience so that you guys can see what it's like. I might not be able to record the surgery and the cutting of everything, <laughs> but we'll be able to talk to my dad before and after and see what it was like and how his vision has changed. Yeah, sounds good. I think the surgery is actually very quick, so uh, looking forward to it. So I guess we'll catch up with you tomorrow on the day of the surgery. So it's the day of the surgery now and we're on the way. And my dad is right here. He's going to say a few words before we go. Hey, it's pretty exciting. Today's the big day. Going to get rid of these glasses today, hopefully, and be able to see clearly with these uh, eyes of mine. So pretty exciting day and uh, looking forward to getting this done. So we made it. And uh, do you want to say anything before? We're ready to go. We got here early. There wasn't much traffic and I'm um, pretty excited to get this going. So, you just got out of surgery and how does it feel? So I've been out of surgery literally five minutes and uh, I can actually see, I can see better than I have in my entire life. Um, it's very quick, it is completely painless. Um, it's scary. It's scary to have somebody doing with something with your eyes that you don't know what they're doing, but it's totally painless and uh, it's very quick. And so I'm supposed to wear these. Um, just pretty much to remind myself not to touch my eyes. So I'm good to go. I'm going to rest the I'm going to rest the rest of the day. <laughs> yeah, there's two rests in there, isn't there? So let's go. I want to give a quick update on my uh, laser eye surgery. I uh, just saw my doctor this morning, less than 24 hours after the surgery, and she says everything looks fantastic. I can see distances. I can see everything. Um, was able to drive to work today without any glasses or any contacts with no problems at all so everything's going great. So we're back and it's been about 10 days since the surgery. So earlier in the video you saw some clips of the actual surgery but do you want to talk a little bit about what your experience was with it? Sure I mean on one hand it seemed to go by very quickly but on the other hand obviously um, it feels like it's taking forever right um, but basically that I was led into a room laid on my back um, and 
The first thing I remember them doing is putting drops in my eyes to sort of numb the eyes. Um, and then they sort of swabbed um, sort of under the eyelid, top and bottom, um, because they're going to be placing something around the eye and don't want to have any irritation there. So I remember them doing that. Um, and then they slipped the, the cylinder on the eye that I remember that I've talked about before. Then they slipped the cylinder on my eye that I think I mentioned before. And then, um, I'm trying to remember. Then they, then they very quickly opened this flap and then they start to count down. And um, actually before the countdown, there's darkness for a couple of seconds. Maybe it's not even a second, but they say before you, it's going to be dark for a second or two, don't worry. And everything goes dark for a second. And then they start to count down. And I remember that they, for one eye, it was a countdown from 15, I think, to zero. And the other one was 23 to zero. So you hear the doctor saying, 23, 22, 21. And, and during that time, you just have to stay as still as you can and look straight forward. And um, it's scary. I, I, don't, I can't really explain why it's scary because it's absolutely painless. But and maybe my reaction isn't normal, but it's, it's pretty scary to basically be getting surgery on your eyes. But um, as I said, it's completely painless. It's very short. And um, as soon as it was over, I sat up, I looked over at you and said, wow, I can actually see my family standing there without um, putting on glasses. Um, and they took me right over and, and measured my eyes and said, hey, everything looks great and pretty much good to go. So how's the recovery process been? So far, it's been pretty good. I think, um, you know, the best thing was I woke up the next morning being able to see and um, be able to just not have to put glasses on and look across the room and be able to see throughout the entire bedroom it was really pretty cool. I've had weekly um, follow-up appointments to check my eyes. Uh, my eyesight is great and my eyes look really healthy. Um, the only thing I've experienced so far is a little bit of dryness. So one of the things that I've had to do is put drops. You can see this little capsule it has uh, basically artificial tears in it. It takes a while for the eyes to recover enough, the nerves to recover for them to learn, relearn how to trigger tears. And so I'm using this so far, but uh, that should clear up. It's very normal to have dry eyes after surgery. And since we didn't really talk about this earlier, what did you do in preparation for the surgery to help your eyes recover? Yeah, good question. Um, in preparation for the surgery, there's a couple things they ask you to do. Um, one of the things is to try to create healthy eyes, make your eyes as healthy as possible prior to the surgery. And so um, they gave me these, uh, Pro Omega tablets, which um, I took uh, every day. And I also took these uh, liquid tears and put those in my eyes every day um, leading up to the surgery. And so my eyes looked great at the time of the surgery and everything went great. Another thing that I think we should talk a little bit about is pain because a lot of people that are watching this video and considering LASIK are maybe afraid of the pain. So do you want to touch on that a little bit and how the pain was during the surgery and during the recovery process? So right before the surgery, I was given a anti-anxiety medication just to keep me calm during the surgery. And then they use um, local um, eye drops to just numb the eyes during the surgery. And surprisingly, it is actually completely painless. There's no pain whatsoever. Um, there's very, very mild sensation of just when they're when you're sort of touching your head or moving your head. Um, you can hear a slight um, sound, but there's no there's actually absolutely no pain whatsoever. So they have to insert something in the eye. It's this um, cylinder shaped object, kind of like this ring, but a bit wider that they put in your eye to keep it open um, and just to make it nice and clear for the surgery. And there's a little bit of pressure with that, but it's very mild. Afterwards, um, there's no pain at all. Um, and as part of the recovery, um, I didn't feel anything. They, they gave me um, optional medicine I could take for anxiety, but I didn't need it. Um, like I said, the only symptom I've had post-surgery is um, some mild dryness. So would you recommend this surgery to other people and how do you think that it has improved your life? Well, I'll start with the second part of it first. Um, in terms of improving things, it's just been great to just have the freedom to not have to worry about contact lenses, not have to worry about glasses. You know, I've, I've started to exercise, who hasn't? You know, it's January, beginning of the year, everybody's got their New Year's resolutions. So I've been running and biking, and it's just great to just wake up, put on your clothes, and go out and go running, go biking, not have to worry about 
glasses, contacts, you know, putting you know, all kinds of gear on. So um, that's just, just been awesome. I also like to play ping pong and, you know, being able to play without having glasses and having better peripheral vision has been, has been really great. Um, first part of your question, in terms of recommendation for others, I would say that for people who really are tired of the hassle of putting contact lenses on and off, um, but still want to have the good vision that you get with contact lenses, um, should try this. You know, it's it's painless. You know, of course, you do have to spend money on it, but um, if you're young enough, it'll pay for itself by not having to buy contact lenses and glasses and contact fluids and all that kind of stuff. So, um, I think it's cost-effective, and I would highly recommend it. So, do you want to talk a little bit about your surgeon and the surgery center that you went to? Sure, so um, my regular eye doctor recommended uh, someone named Dr. Mashat. Dr. Mashat is at Envision Eye Centers in San Francisco. Yeah, and it was great. I went up there for a consultation and uh, the first thing they do is kind of check your eyes and make sure you're a candidate because not everyone is a candidate for this because due to eye shape um, and, and other things that might be going on. Once they figure out what types of procedures you're a candidate for, they kind of sit down and walk you through them. Make sure you understand the risks and benefits associated with it, kind of walk it through. And then once you decide to move forward, they sort of work everything out and schedule schedule the surgery. So um, Dr. Mashat and um, the other doctors that are there are really great. Um, they sort of talked to me throughout the surgery and just made sure I was aware of everything that was going on. And I've been just uh, really great to work with. So all their info will be linked down below if you're interested in getting surgery there. So check them out. So is my dad's LASIK experience. If you have any questions, feel free to comment them down below. That's right, and I'll jump in and try to answer as many as I can. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video. Goodbye.